Are Ren Santos and Paulo Conte still together? Hey guys, welcome back to the Vin Review. It's your boy Melvin, and today we are talking about Paulo Conte and Yen Santos and Aras and Augustine. But before we get into this video, please subscribe to the channel for more content. And yeah, let's get into it. So, on the recent episode of Eat Bulanga, um, netizens noticed that Paulo Conte was getting too close to fellow host Aras and Augustine. Okay, they were too close and he was getting a bit handsy with her. Okay, and it was super uncomfortable to watch. Okay, knowing that Paulo Contes has a girlfriend. Okay, now all of this was going on. They were hugging each other and, you know, Paulo Contes even went in for a kiss. I think he kissed her on the forehead and they really, really seemed so close. So, so many people started pointing it out and asking, why is he getting too handsy with her? Because we all know that he has a girlfriend and her name is, you know, Yen Santos. Okay, so this is the big question. Why is Paulo Contes getting too handsy with another chick while we know that, you know, he is together with someone? Okay? Like, it does not make sense. His behavior is just out of line. Okay? Paulo Contes is such a flirt and at this point he can't even hide it. Okay? But then again, is he still together with Yen Santos? Because, you know, their relationship has, has kind of been silent for a very long time now. And I don't know. I think there's something here. I think that there's something that they're not telling people. And I feel like maybe they have even broken up or their relationship is, is at a very bad place right now. And they just don't want to tell us. Okay. And you know what? I'm happy that this is happening because we all know what they did to LJ Reyes, how they broke her heart, and we are thankful that LJ Reyes found a man that loved her, and now Yen Santos, you know, right now she is probably getting cheated on herself by, you know, Paulo Contes. And now she's super silent because she has to take what she dished out. You know, I'm just so excited that, you know, Paulo Contes is embarrassing her in the Philippines, okay? She is just embarrassing her, okay? Because his behavior... Because his behavior with Aras and Augustine was just so um, uncomfortable to watch. Like, why was this man getting so handsy with this chick? And you know what? And I have a message for Aras and Augustine. Girl, run. Like, this man is no good. He is going to pursue you and he is going to leave you. He just gets bored so easily. And we have seen it with two baby mamas. And now we are seeing him do it to Yen Santos. So you are the next one on his hit list and after he gets with you, he is going to get bored and he is going to dump you. That is what he does. That is what Paulo Contes is known for. Do not entertain that man. That man is trouble. Miss Aras and Augustine, please listen to me. Run. This man is big, big trouble and you do not want to enter that list of women he, you know, got with and just left because he gets bored way too easily. Okay, he is, you know, a teenager at heart. Please do not do it. You will regret it very much if you get with him. Now, honestly, all of this is alleged. Okay, this is just alleged information. We do not know what is going on between them in that relationship. But all I can say is he is bored of Yen Santos. Okay, he is bored of her and he just wants a way out. And Aras and Augustine is the way out. You know, he is... You know, she is the new um, flavor that, you know, he wants and he will stop at nothing until he gets her. And then after that, he will move on because that's just who he is. He is just a weird, weird man who is never satisfied with whatever he has. Anyway, guys, tell me, what do you think about this entire Yen Santos, Aras and Augustine and Paulo Contes situation? Do you think Paulo Contes is going after Aras and Augustine now? If so, please tell me down below in the comment section. Do not forget to like and subscribe and have an amazing day. Bye.